Gamers get pumped! This year's Madden is finally here! What's going on? I'm Mike Janela for 8012. We wait for it every summer and for 28 years now it delivers. We're ready to wax nostalgic on just how much Madden has grown up with us. From the very first console game in 1990 to the Rob Gronkowski powered movie trailer version out now. Here are the five biggest differences between original Madden and Madden 16. At number five, the original Madden console game in 1990 wasn't just for consoles. The Madden franchise had PC versions of itself the first three years of its existence. Seems crazy to think about playing Madden 16 on your desktop, but it actually wasn't until the 09 version that Madden went exclusively console. At number four, the competition. When Madden debuted, it was going up against Joe Montana football, ABC Monday Night Football, and Tech Mobile. Now, thanks to its exclusive NFL rights deal, Madden football is literally the only game in town. What those rights give you is real teams and players. At number three, original Madden came with 16 base teams that use real NFL colors, but no team nicknames or real player names. Today, the players and teams are so real, another annual tradition is guys complaining their ratings in the game are too low. At number two, the original Madden lets you pick from around 100 plays in the playbook. That's really cute. The number of new plays Madden 16 added just on top of last year is 600. At number one, money, money, money. That first Madden sold about 400,000 copies on Sega. Great for the time. Last year's Madden has sold more than five million. So think of how far Madden has come when you fire up the PS4 this week. Except playing as the Jets. It's as bad an idea now as it was then. Happy gaming from 8012. Thanks for watching 8012. Like our videos, subscribe to our channel, and leave a comment. If you want to call me the Khaleesi of YouTube, I'm cool with that.